Good morning. Good morning, sir. To all of you, a beautiful day, a nice climate. We don't require any kind of ventilation. It is my obligation or a commitment. I must welcome all of you once again for this wonderful observance and program. And then I'm supposed to give a special note on this day for the sake of my new children, a new addition to this well seasoned and experienced institute and Rina Karmahavya College of Pharmacy. So before welcoming you all, it is my, du my duty and prime duty as the director of Nandri Nagar Mahapyalaya College of Pharmacy to express my gratitude and thankfulness to the parents of first diploma students of the new edition because there are hundreds of pharmacy institutes in Uttar Pradesh and thousands of institutes in India. In spite of all, your parents and you combinedly have chosen my institute as the study center for your two-year certificate diploma in pharmacy course. Right? And so, I express my gratitude to your parents and to you. Next, once I express my gratitude, now you have become very close to me. You are all the newest children of this institute for this academic session. You are going to undergo your first year diploma in pharmacy. In this institute, you are going to begin with your grand success in your life. Dear students, today we have a special guest. He is always special. Respected Ram Kripa Singh Ji, who has consented, agreed, and presently appeared to the function by 10.55 in order to start the function by 11 o'clock. It is a kind of encouragement he wanted to give to the faculty of pharmacy as well as to the newcomers and other students of pharmacy. So first of all, I give my lovely and respectful and virtual thanks to our Ram Kripa Singhji. Thank you for being with us and spending your valuable time with us in this morning. The heroes of the day are my second year diploma students. They are the heroes. The first year students are the students of the day. For you, the function is being celebrated. And the heroes of the day are the second year diploma students. Whether they have experience in their school lives or in their college life over here in Andrinagar, I was not sure, but I gave the opportunity of proceeding this function and conduct of this function, and they have taken it with the courage and very beautifully and very excellently they have arranged this function. Without any of our help, except the guidance of the Mr. Coordinator, Mr. Gray, and other our teachers of Diploma first year. Yes. Right? With their guidance, they have not approached me even when maximum they would have stayed with me for 10 minutes towards the arrangement of this function. But they are all very beautiful students. They have taken it with their courage and very successfully they are proceeding this function. It's a historic function in their life, your life and my life. Right? And uh, I must welcome the coordinator of this course, Mr. Vinay Yadav. And uh, he is a lean personality.
energy with the utmost energy in each and every work. Right? He has guided his faculty member and students in a nice way. Now the function is very smoothly being proceeded. And I also welcome all my diploma faculty members who are all the backbone of this institute and for the conduct of the first year diploma and second year diploma course. And they are all here. So my friendly welcome to them also. Then, I need not repeat my welcome address uh, to our second year. They are the heroes of the day. Already I mentioned my appreciation also belongs to them. And uh, the first year students are the students of the day. For you, the function is being celebrated. For you, this arrangement has been made in this institute. For you, the college is going to dedicate itself and I am going to dedicate myself along with my colleague to make you up eligible to meet the tomorrows of this world. And so, I very heartfully welcome you all, all the 22 students of Diploma in Pharmacy in this institute. You are all my pride and you have to reflect our names when you go and meet the society after the completion of your course and you will be taken due care of this institute. You are not going to be only the students, you are going to be my daughter and son and it is my duty to look after you and shape you well and set up the institute. So, no more, no more any part of the seas or contraries that you are just students of the institute. No, you are all children of this institute. Okay? You have all the freedom, freeness, and all strength to communicate with us, mingle with us, and celebrate with us, and live happy with us. Right? I welcome you all along with your parents and express my gratitude once again for selecting my suspension. And then, we should not forget one important workforce. Right? All my faculty members and other students, also I welcome. Today they will not be present because they are going to meet examination and they are all preparing for their internal examination. So other students are not a part of this function. However, there are several faculty members are here. And I should not forget to offer a respectful welcome to the dean and the next man of the institute, Professor Dr. Fahim, Muhammad Fahim. Welcome, sir, for this function. And, uh, the workforce, what I told is uh, office staff members. Especially two administrators I should mention for you because they are your future communication. Okay? The head of the office is uh, Mr. Rajesh Srivastava and uh, Registrar Kamp, Chief Accountant of NNM COP, Nandrinagar Mahavdiyaday Kalaja Pharmacy Office, Mr. Rakshat Bharti. These two are very important instrument for me to run this institute successfully both in academic as well as in administration and they are also present my hearty welcome to you all and uh, along with that Mr. Pandey is also there he is the store in charge of office assistant and uh, along with that uh, some of the lab technicians are also here they have assistants out there I welcome you all so the welcome address is now over I welcome you all I hope that I have not forgotten anybody have you forgotten anybody? No, so, even if I have forgotten, my welcome to one and a half. Okay? Then, dear students, first being the director of this institute, I must introduce myself to you because you may be knowing, you may be knowing my figure. Now you might have come to a conclusion he is head of the institute, that's all, but you may not be knowing about me. So today, first today, I am meeting you, so I must introduce myself. You want to know a little bit about me also. Right? Yeah. Right. I was born in a village in Tamil Nadu, namely Sayanamudi. It is belonging to Ramanathapuram district. Right? Water scarcity area there. Raining will be very there. Such a district is in the Ramanathapuram district. Rameshwaram, you may be knowing Rameshwaram. Nearby that. Okay? Abdul Ram of Malukhana. Yes, sir. His birthplace is Rameshwaram. It is just 70 km from my native place. Okay? I am from that district. Right? And I did my schooling in village of South Standard and from 8th standard to 12th standard I did my study in Dera Kana High Secondary School, Madurai and Madurai. And after completing my school life, 
I joined when you diploma in pharmacy at Karsana Yu College of Pharmacy. That time it was one year course in 1991 I completed. I was the best outgoing student of the college. I was the gold medalist of the college. And after completion of my diploma, my interest in teaching was well, very well appreciated when I happened to take seminars in the classroom. And so all my teachers and my colleagues encouraged me to undergo a degree in the same institute. Then I got appointed in the same institute, 1992, the first year, second year, third year, final year, all. I was the best outgoing student and gold medalist in distinction, the distinction I passed. Right? Then I worked as a humble tutor and then as a lecturer for three years in an institute as well as in my institute itself. And I was taking pharmacology for third year students with my bachelor degree produced 100% result by handing around 99 classes in a year. That was the record of the college never produced. So after seeing my teaching interest, everybody encouraged me again to stick with the teaching profession, though I was very much interested in industry, industrial job for a good income. And then I happened, I got appointed or admitted in Madras Medical College and Research Institute. That was one of the first institute in India, Pharmacy Institute developed where I got a master's degree, there were two seats in Tamil Nadu, I got one seat with a scholarship of 7,000 per month that time. The time it was around 1999. And I did, I passed by a pharmacy with the 84% age, with the distinction, right, in pharmacology and phytochemistry, my speciality. Then I continued my career in Ajamgar, and then I came to Nandini In 2003, I got here as my job as lecturer, then was promoted as senior lecturer here itself, and then became an assistant professor, then the senior, then associate professor, and as a professor I retired from this institute in the year 2012, and I did my PhD from UP Technical University, now it is called as your university, Abdul Technical University, that time its name was UP Technical University, I did my research in Viburnum, then species, three species of plant was selected, and I structured resonated five compounds that I isolated in this college, in this college, Pharma Congress Laboratory is memorable for me. I did my all research work over here and Pharma College India, Pharma College in Phytochemistry, everything I completed. I published from my thesis around 45 research papers. So my thesis was <laughs> And after completion of my PhD, I got appointed as a principal in Andhra and then I went to Kerala and then I went to Tamil Nadu, after two years in service in Tamil Nadu, I came back to this institute in 2023, February I joined here and I took the charge of the director, right, so over here. So I have a very long finding with this institute, right, so that I am to the end that the institute should grow, my students should also grow, along with that I must grow, is my time. This is about me, okay. I published so far four books, two online, two offline. To offline group one pharmacology and pharmacology as well as the service of pharmacy council of India for diploma students and degree students. Okay. Apart from that, I published so far 63 and one paper was ordered by Mr. Sunil, one more paper published. So 64 research paper I published in national and international journals, right? And uh, two PhD students I released, right? Two people awarded in pharmacology, pharmacology and pharmacology from Andhra University, right? Hyderabad University. So this is about me. I am a, I am a guest lecturer to foreign countries like Africa and in India, in several universities, I proceeded. I took the chair of chairmanship for conduct of a lot of academic program and conferences. Okay? I am a judge or a referee for three international channels. This is my history. You are not What is my special <laughs> today? If you look at the YouTube channel of my own, the channel name is Professor Dr. K. Prabhuski. is the YouTube channel address. When you type this, there will be around 45 videos. In which one of the videos, three months back when I when I completed first year student of degree, I gave a speech of around 25 to 30 minutes where I explain what is the history of pharmacy. Okay? Okay, sir. Who are our pharmacists? What is the history of pharmacy? In which prehistoric era, 
how many people were there, how pharmacist was there as a category, and how he was called as a pharmacist, when the pharmacist got separated from medicine, and what, how many people learned medicine by instinct and by accident. And then I came to middle era, historic era, what are all the countries, right? Like Middle East country, and West Eastern country, and Asian country, where were medicines and pharmacists all, all very distinctively identified it, and how the latest medicines arrived. And in the 19th century, the first thing what was only we have come to a very modernized uh, that is profession of pharmacy, where we have we have been given much importance in this country. Okay? So okay. that everything you can see if I talk, another one hour I will talk. That's not needed. Okay. Another half hour or one hour speech is not needed. You can see the video and you can understand how the pharmacy evolved. Okay. Okay, so, sir. within one minute, I can complete my speech after saying that pharmacy, in the sense, it is your profession, number one. It is a very well researched, modern, multidisciplinary, and independent science now in this world. Okay? It is being controlled by the education industry, it is being controlled by Pharmacy Council of India. The Pharmacy Council of India, it is in the Okay? It is the public body to control over education industry of pharmacy. Okay? It offers around four types of courses in India. Okay? Diploma in pharmacy, degree in pharmacy, post graduation in pharmacy, doctorate in pharmacy. Understand? Yes, the degree in pharmacy has the farm and the farm D programs. What is industry oriented, what is hospital oriented. Understand? Yes. Diploma is both. Very rarely industrial, but maximum practice oriented course in our courses. Okay. What is a doctor and what is a pharmacist? What is pharmacy? Simple word is a pharmacist or professional dealing with the drugs. Okay. What kind of dealing they are doing with the drug? It is starting from invention, discovery, development, formulation, patient administration, counseling, <coughs> and pharmacovigilance. Right? Survey, marketing, all together will be called as a pharmacy. Understand? What is the difference between me and a doctor? People should be able to differentiate that. Doctors are dealing with the diagnosis and surgery. Diagnosis and the surgery. And nurses will assist the doctor in both things. As well as little patient, very good patient care. You understand? And what is the pharmacy state? We are not going to do it surgery. We are not going to do any kind of a diagnosis of diseases. We are not going to treat the patient by sticking to him and following formulas. Our duty is to create drugs and make available in the world. Thereby, doctors and nurses will be able to care the patients. You understand? So for that, 50% of the health sector is being dominated by our pharmacy profession. We are all dealing with the drugs and patient care and counseling. This will be the major area of ours, as well as industrial development. Industrial development. After 18th, 18th century, 18th century it started. 18th century it started. However, still now it has a very good development, and there are thousands of uh, industries out there. But we farm, we farm, and we the students are taking jobs over there. Surfacing, this is our profession. So you know now what is pharmacy. Pharmacy is a profession in which drugs are prepared and supplied. The prepared will indicate a lot of works, supplied will indicate a lot of works. You understand now? Who is a pharmacist? Yeah. So these are the things I wanted to give you a special note. Okay. Apart from that, some our faculty members will give you some more knowledge also. I will come to you tomorrow, day after tomorrow. I will spend one hour with you to explain what are the different departments, different subjects you have, and how to study that, right? Everything. Clear? So now you have come to a new institute and uh, it is going to be new only for hours. Then you will be accustomed to the situation and you will become the students of this institute. Being students of the institute and we are the second key, second parent, we will take care of you from A to Z. Nothing to worry about. You need not have any kind of a strange feeling that uh, optional or something away from home or nothing. Your family is this, this college. It will treat you as a family member. You understand? So you will have all the freedoms. You can come and meet me at any time. You can come and meet your faculty at any time. Any problem you can openly express and get it solved. You understand? The Sachin Institute of Radhinagar Mahavyaya College of Pharmacy. 
any kind of a issue with your yeah. qualification, registration, and payment, everything. There are our office, I introduce you to people, office people, you can meet them at any time and you can apply for us. So, please now. And my phone number is 897 and my mail ID is prabhu.bhavnasi at the rate of gmail.com as well as uh, you can also put mail to director dnnc nnncop at the rate of gmail.com also dnncop and prabhu.bhavnasi at gmail.com any two mail addresses anything you can mail to me and you can get to right okay? okay now once again I take this opportunity to welcome all my new children of 2023-24 first year to pharmacy and have a very beautiful life. Thank you very much.